Only I will first destroy them all so that they do not interfere with me. And after that, no one will complain that the sun is shining too brightly. Oh no, uh, not that. That's what it is. How many of these houses are there in general? What kind of nonsense is this? Why should I destroy them all? For what? So, I don't know what to tell you about this. I don't know what to do. I don't want to destroy them so much, but it seems that we have no choice at all. And now let's not do it, because I don't want to waste my time on it at all. And it's your fault. So now we have to do it as soon as possible. Let's finish this already. Oh my god. Mikey, who else is this? What is this son? You, what do you want to tell me? Oh no. Don't tell me that because of him, you can't talk because of him. I don't want to do this. I'm already tired of guessing what you want to tell me. Oh my god. So, tell me, did you have only one obsidian in your hands? Or what were you thinking at all when you did it? It seems to me that you're crazy. Oh no. What else is this? Is this the sun you told me about? It's kind of scary, JJ. It seems you're right. Let's not get out of here yet. So let's not talk about it anymore, although you can't tell me anything. What a horror. There are some sun rays here, and you can't talk either. It seems that I'm already starting to go crazy. But what should we do now? I don't understand what to do. Mikey, uh, this is all very cool, of course. But you do understand that we can't get out of here now because the shark is watching us. And it won't let us leave this village so easily. So let's think something. Hey, where are you going? What are you already up to tell me? Let's sneak into one of these houses. Maybe we can find something useful. And in general, this village seems abandoned. But why? Of course I have a couple of options for how this could happen. But I'd better keep quiet for now. Let's see what we can find in this house. Now I'll help you. I think I figured out how and what is being done here. So look at this sun with a head and tentacles. Now it will just fall to the bottom. Why didn't you tell me about this before? I thought it was impossible, so I could handle them myself. But it would take me too long. You're still a better killer than me. Oh, it seems I appeared on enemy territory. I didn't expect this at all. And I hope that now I won't stay here forever. I still want to live. But I can't explain it to them. They won't understand it at all. Oh my god, how many guards they have here. It seems that it's impossible to get here unnoticed at all. And I don't know what to do here now. I hope that I won't die here. I've already said that. Okay, now I have to find the sorcerer who is the most important here. I have a serious conversation with him. And I hope that he is still in the village. Because I really need him. I think everyone understands why. Okay. He's definitely in this village. And I can handle him now. So now I'm going to get up and do what all the villagers dream of. And now, this hour has come. Come here. So, I, of course, everything is fine, but I must not forget why I came here at all, and I will not forget it. But first I have to find something in these graves. I hope that I was not deceived. I was told that their former boss is buried here with all his resources. But it seems that this looks like some kind of lie. JJ, you've become somewhat moody lately. I understand that it's not the easiest task to fight the sun, but you still managed, right? But if you came to me, I understand that you did not succeed in anything. And judging by the fact that your friend is not with you, his fans. So now I'll do it. You have very huge hands, and you will be able to reach this sun and already do what you want but you have to do so that your friend does not die. Can you shut up for a minute? What's wrong with you? Why are you always telling me something? Do you think that this way she will resurrect faster or what you hope for? I don't understand. I gave you everything you need. Just do what you have to do and you know what to do because we already did it with you when Mikey fell under the train and we saved him in exactly the same way. Or have you already forgotten? I know that you haven't forgotten. So let's push the lever so that potions are thrown into it. And I hope that you won't make a mistake. And you didn't accidentally put garbage in there. It seems that these potions were not enough. We still have to use them. But it seems that they were all that were lying in my chest. Okay, let's do this. So let's not do anything superfluous anymore. Now it seems to me that this will be enough. Well, at least I hope so. The main thing is that everything would be as it should be. Yes, we did it. Look, she's the same as she was now. 
I'm so glad that we were able to do it. So let's just be friends with you. I always knew that I could rely on you. So, but I think this is just the beginning. So let's do something useful. For example, let's take revenge on these toilets before it's too late. Now that son got what they deserve and how glad I am that I did it. And in such a cool way, they probably don't even understand what happened and who did it all. But I think they will soon understand when I destroy them all here. Then everyone will care exactly whether they understand something or not. So, golems, come on. It's your time to die. Great. I returned the star that they stole. And now they won't be able to take anything from us at all. I won't let them do it. So now I can be calm for my village and the villagers. But this is just the beginning. I have to cope with everything here and so that there would be nothing left of them. Because I'm already tired of doing this. I think that everyone already understands this, but still. I see that you've already found it yourself. Yes, I know what it is. Now I'll even tell you where I've seen it before. So this is from YouTube. Am I right? Yes. Guys, like and subscribe to the channel. This is very important for us because we are waiting for you to be active. Okay? And also, do not forget to leave your comments. We also constantly read them and it will be very entertaining for us. I hope that we will remain heard. Guys, I hope so too, but now let's get away from here because it's very cold here. I think you understand that yourself, okay? Son, where are you going? Did you decide to fly away from here without me? Or what are you even up to? Or do you think I wouldn't have noticed you flying somewhere, okay? I would too. I've never seen this. It's actually real. It doesn't seem to us. It's not a dream because I'm seeing it for the first time. Do you know whose it is? This is very cool. So let's look around here. Maybe we can find something interesting here. Or is there some kind of security guard or caretaker behind the yacht? So come on, stand here and you will be the strongest and coolest in this city. And now you will also have the most powerful weapon of all. So don't even be afraid of that. Something will go wrong and I hope that you know how to use it and we are doing it all for a reason. But alas, we can't help you with anything because he's too strong and we can only modify one, so that's it. I think you can handle him because no one else has a weapon like you. JJ, you've become somewhat moody lately. I understand that it's not the easiest task to fight the sun, but you still managed, right? But if you came to me, I understand that you did not succeed in anything. And judging by the fact that your friend is not with you, his fan. Okay, I understand you. Thank you for your support. Now I'll deal with him. He's not as cool as he was before and he no longer has a chance to survive. I guarantee him that. Well, are you not as cool as you used to be? How do you like me now or did you not expect this? But alas, you can't get away from here anymore. You're going to die here now. You shouldn't have decided to come here at all. I will take revenge on you for all that you have done. So don't even think that you will live. You are now doomed to death. And I will make sure that you don't get out of here alive. And don't doubt, I will keep my word. Do you understand me? Come on, come here if you're so cool, but alas, nothing will work out for you. I won't even let you come here. So give up quickly so that I just destroy you. Oh wait, what is it? What happened? Guys, I have great news. I, I defeated him. So now we can live in peace as before and no one can stop us now. To be honest, I thought it would be more difficult, but as it turned out, he's not as scary as you told me. So guys, now I'm the most dangerous person in this city and everyone will know about it. Am I right? No, I won't give up. Don't even hope for it. You won't succeed. You won't be able to destroy me. Don't even think about it. So just stand there and watch me run away from you. Do you understand me? Mikey, how did you turn into the sun in the first place? Why didn't I notice it right away? And why didn't I turn into a zombie? Or is it just a matter of time? And there's some kind of virus here. I have so many questions, but I don't have any answers. Why are you running after me? What are you trying to achieve? Do you really think you can catch up with me or even beat me? I wouldn't be so sure if I were you, but I won't even tell you anything. It's pointless. How funny you are. I don't even know how to react to your words because everything you do is really meaningless. So just don't tell me anything. I know exactly what to do so that you become the same as us. Do you understand me? Why do you keep living? Do you really think that you can destroy me or leave? You're just wasting my time. And where did you run to anyway? Why did you eat the cake? And what are you doing? What kind of naive you are? I can't even believe that I've been friends with you for so many years. You don't represent anything at all. You're just nobody and you don't have a name. I hope that at least you yourself understand this. 
Where are you going? You can't hide from me. I know the whole city, and I can get you wherever you are. Do you think if you shut the door behind you, it means that I won't be able to find you anymore? You're not serious about this? Hey, wait, where did he go? I remember exactly that he was running away here, but now I don't see him. Hmm, it's all very strange, but I'll find you, so don't hope that you'll hide. Okay, I'm tired of all this. I'm tired of playing these games with you. Now it's time to talk to you seriously because you don't understand ordinary words. So come on, come here or not, let's better I'll come to you to destroy you. I think this is the best option of all those that can be possible and you don't bother me, otherwise you will die. I warned you and you didn't listen to me, so you get what you deserve. And don't you dare blame me for this because everyone knows that only I am the best of us, not you. So you lost the first battle. But this is just the beginning, so accept it. You will lose more than once. No, you're just lucky, and it won't happen again. So get off my body and don't come any closer to me for a single block, so that I don't see you here anymore. I hope that you understand me, and yet you will listen and not make any more mistakes, because I will simply destroy you. I already have everything necessary for this, and I warn you. Don't come near me, because next time you won't be able to do the same, I'll just throw you to the bottom, and everyone will forget about you and about the fact that you can beat someone. You said the same thing before. And how did it all end? You just flew off into the abyss. And this will happen every time until you finally realize that you have no chance of defeating me. And anyway, why do you still think that you can beat me? Have you seen how much I've already done and what do I have? No, you haven't, and you won't see it, because I'll leave it for later, so just wait for your fate, and when the time comes, you'll understand that I was right, and you only hindered me to win. You didn't even fight me. I've already destroyed them, so don't worry, and now let's take a look around here. There must clearly be something useful, and now I think I found this chest. I hope you don't mind it, right? I do not know how it happens, but we are constantly defeating them. I understand that we are much smarter than these zombies, but do not forget that there are too many of them here, and there are only two of us. And until recently, we did not have a decent weapon. Am I right or not? Hmm. It's very dangerous to fight them openly, so we have to come up with some kind of plan. And I think I have an idea how to do it, so stay here. I'll come back here now. I think that this green car is no longer useful to anyone, so I'll take a couple of blocks from here. And now we'll make a barrier in front of the door so that the zombies can't get out of here. And now we can destroy them so that they couldn't even reach us. Well, Mikey, how do you like my plan? I'm a genius. Mikey, everything will be fine with you. I'll cure you. I've already practically cured you. So now you won't be a zombie. Hmm, it seems that you haven't completely healed yet, so I'll help you. I have treatment potions for you. You'll be the same. I promise you that. Only you need to wait a little. I think that you yourself understand that the potion can't work immediately. So come on, follow me, and everything will be fine with you. I can guarantee that. But don't hit me. I don't want you to destroy me. So you got caught, what? You're not so cool now that you have nowhere to run now? But don't be afraid. I'll do everything quickly so you won't even feel anything. Don't resist me. No one will help you anymore. So you will die here. So don't even hope that you can survive. Hey, what did you find there? What else is it? Where did the potion chest come from? Oh no, not that. How did it happen in the first place? And what are you doing to me? I don't deserve this. So, now the main thing for me is to concentrate on the problem and figure out how to solve it while there is still such an opportunity. So first I'll take Mikey to the village. Maybe they can help him there. There must be someone who knows this or will do it. And if you want to tell us something, write it in the comments. When Mikey is alive again, he will definitely read everything. I will make him do it myself. But that's it. Stop distracting me. I have to help my friend while there is still such an opportunity. But I don't like what I see at all. It feels like there are no villagers left in the village. JJ, I'm cured. So let's destroy all these zombies. And no one will stop us now because there are two of us now, which means that we have now become twice as strong and angrier. I'm so glad that you were able to cure me after all, so let's get this over with, because I already hate all these sons and everything related to them, and I know that you think so too. But nothing will help you anymore, so don't even think about the fact that you can survive today. I will return my friend his ability to speak. Come on, come here if you're not afraid of me, of course. 
but you don't have any point in fighting with you at all. Because I already understand that you can't oppose anything to me, and in general, you saw yourself, you're a red creeper. What's wrong with you? Okay, it's time for me to finish with you. So I have to say goodbye to you. You won't take your voice away from anyone else. Only I don't know how long I'll be there. Someone told me that time in hell goes faster than in the ordinary world, which means that I can be there for a very long time. And when I come back, it may be too late to help him, but I hope that I can quickly cope with this, and in general, it's time for me to go to hell. Hmm, it's very strange here. I've never been here before, and I hope I won't, because I'm not comfortable being here at all. And in general, it's very hot here. I noticed it. So I shouldn't be distracted at all. I didn't come here for an excursion, and I have to find the star of hell, or somehow figure out where to find this star, but I don't have any ideas. Okay, okay, I'm not going to do this. So now let's go home with you. We've had enough of this sun for today, okay? So, let's go to bed. I think we've already done enough interesting things for today. Tomorrow is a new day. So sweet dreams to you. And sweet dreams to you, too. 